Today on Robert Knows, we're going to learn how a house is built and what jobs there are on a construction site. Let's get started. What are those guys doing there? A construction worker wearing a tie? What's up with that? I think that is the architect. When someone decides to build a new house, it all begins with an idea. Ah. This is the architect's job. He thinks about how the house should look. Then he draws out the exact plan that is used to build the house. When everyone agrees on the plan, the actual construction work can begin. The materials required are delivered by truck to the construction site. A load loader, like that, is very large and heavy. To drive the truck to the exact position so that the crane can unload it, the truck driver must be very skillful. The same is also true for the drivers of the dump truck and the cement mixer. I reckon it would be a ton of fun to drive those big trucks. Wow! To build a house, lots of other vehicles and machines are needed, as well as the trucks. Bigger machines, such as the excavator or the crane, are operated by specially trained people. These people are real experts who can operate their machines with unbelievable precision. Only when all the materials required are on site and the foundation is set can things really start to happen. Now, lots of different specialists get to work. The job of the concrete and steel workers is to build a structure that is stable and strong. The crane driver operates the big crane. Scaffolding is set up by the scaffolding builder. The bricklayers build walls. The master painter makes sure the correct paint is used. The electrician looks after all the electrical connections and the plumber lays the pipes for the water. Sounds like it's nearly finished. Well, it doesn't take long to build a house nowadays, with all those machines. In the olden days, it used to take a lot longer. For example, it took many, many years to build the palace. The palace? We wanted to visit the palace again, if it is open. Yeah, exactly! That's right, but we'll do that the next time. Bye! See you soon!